This is honestly pretty crazy. Saw this circling around Twitter. WTF Robinhood. AMC is not filed for bankruptcy. Short and distort tactics. Hashtag Robinhood short and distort. So this was floating around over the last day or so, and it says this company has filed for bankruptcy. And this looks like it's on the Robinhood app, and this tag is on none other than AMC Entertainment. So since earlier today, a lot of apes are saying that this is no longer actually on the app, but the main concern is obviously, why would something like this, why would a tag like this be on the AMC Entertainment page on the Robinhood app or any app for that matter in the first place? A tag like this on a trading brokerage could obviously be very devastating to any publicly traded company. Let's say an everyday investor wanted to log in to Robinhood or any other brokerage and wanted to buy some shares of AMC Entertainment or any other stock for that matter. And they saw this tag above where it says this company has filed for bankruptcy. What do you think that would make that investor want to do? This needs to be looked into now. This tape says I don't trust anything anymore. When it comes to mainstream media, critics, analysts, celebrity endorsements, it's all sus. Critics tore up the Mario movie. Took my wife, her boyfriend, and the kids. Best movie I've seen in a while. I laughed a lot. I even cried. Nostalgia. And the whole place erupted at the end. But the mainstream media said the theaters are dead. Nope. There are more people at the theaters in the mall that it was connected to. The critics said that the movie was crap, but it was amazing. And as we were leaving, everyone agreed that they would pay to see it again. The analysts say sell. I shouldn't even have to say it, but inverse grammar. I buy, I hodl, and don't care what anyone else thinks. Very well said. This ape says why I'm here. I'm 37 and I've always been upper lower class. I've always survived, but I've always been broke. There have been many things I could have invested in, but didn't. I didn't have the money at the time. Any of the newer tech companies, Bitcoin, etc. But when the meme stocks broke out, I picked that one that made the most sense. I'm here so I don't miss out again when it happens, or if it happens. I won't have the regretful hindsight about not investing in AMC when I could have. Now let's be real here, AMC is down a lot from the all-time highs. But from where it's trading at right now, and for the actual fundamentals and all of the bullish catalysts that the company has in front of it, does it seem at this point like there's more upside or downside from here? I guess only time will tell.